when we working with uh, the snow for example you can uh, have uh, also the effects of the um, it's very teeny your uh, uh, your snow because you don't see with your eyes the effects but uh, sometimes it's very nice to use also the system for creating the rotation because uh, here now when we come back on my system for example if I jump up I can create the copy two points and so I can create the each you can try with uh, create the e for each loop just for uh, create a good effects or for help would you need to work in better no that's here that is come here now if I copy some elements like for example I can uh, create uh, the another grid maybe I can yeah Zero point zero one, and I copy, and I have here maybe now is explode my computer because I copy a lot of points here, okay? But uh, anyway, it's copy is perfect, it's copy. Yeah. Also, I can uh, take only the pop object, pop object. You see your element it's uh, not have any rotation okay it's moved but uh, all element is uh, it's not have, have any rotation the time any kind of position you can move it that maybe we can decrease a little bit yeah that for example And I'm back here you see the particle is uh, create and is moved also is moved with the turbulence effects and this is very nice but I don't have any kind of spin or rotation in the time here and sometimes it's good also apply the, the effects of spin or torque and for this I can use the operator here inside there is one operator is called pop torque and we have also the pop spin okay honestly when I see that the first time I say okay what I can do with that how I can work in with that here we have the mount we have the axis uh, and the torque essentially is take one point like uh, the position is my origin point is the point and then is go to create the, the spin the rotation by looking this point and the spin is uh, moving around from the object uh, from the uh, pivot point or the centroid of your object but usually I it's more you can say okay use that use the spin speed for example it's uh, you can this is in degrees uh, 40 degrees you can use that I can put this here also maybe we can disable now for just one moment my effects of wind and also I can copy that here and disable because I want to show you what is do that come back here also we can uh, because here we can see but here we have also the operator is called pop instance pop instance it uh, help uh, us for create here we can call for example yeah okay we create here the null object and I can call that 
and here I can want it one and one the minimum yeah maybe we can need the two two and two because one one is not to exist and that I can copy that name come back on pop net and here in the pops I can dot dot slash dot dot slash and I can call the pistons okay and now when I go I, it's a call for pistons yeah I see we, we have that now why is not a gray because it's the instance it's like the object is taken only for reference it's not working for that and here you can see if you have your you can spin okay wow it's spin if I change the axis for example for one for x I have a difference oh, wow it's spin okay spin 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 but I want, uh, for example, assign the difference uh, or the random value. So I can uh, also here, we can see, we can have the scale, we can have the different kind, for example, rotation onto the plane. You can see what's happened. When I arrive to the plane after. Also, you can use, for example, the pass through. However, we can also come here and write, for example, the random effects. I can say my spin speed. Okay. Maybe I can open also in the standard expression editor. And I want to say spin speed. It's equal to you can multiply that and, for example, use uh, the random value, random open parenthesis and can recall for example the ID of my particle set ID and also I can fit this random if you want so I can say fit 0 1 so it's random this value and you can take for example one speed from uh, for example 0 the new the minimum and the maximum is maybe is 10 this is uh, maybe could be the one of your system you can use it also you can use the channel you can say channel open parentheses and you can create your channel for control your element also here the axis I can split my axis in three dimensional because the axis is, is uh, X Y and Z so axis dot X so we can assign the specific for this axis. Maybe the axis, it's uh, also in this case, I can say it's random and uh, I can recall that random. Random ID, I can multiply, for example, for some value, for example, two. And um, this is, could be my expression and I can copy that and assign here and here and for for example y and here I can say for z and also I can change for example the value I can say for example my value here it's multiply for uh, for example 10 and here maybe it's multiply for example for uh, 100 so you can have the difference here also i can maybe add more information okay i can uh, for example say also that is, uh, is it's okay for information that information it's okay for now and uh, you can say for example you can save that that too. We have the error here. We can try if I say, for example, uh, minus one. No, 
he don't love that I copy that here no he is continued to don't love that random ID random ID also I can say for example float random equals random here and write for example only random you can see with variable maybe it's working better control key okay and now when I go here You can see it's more random effects okay also you can for example assign more variable more uh, points so for example you can multiply more for example i can say that is multiply for two and that is multiply for three and also i can say this is minus uh, one you can see what's happening now yeah we have more variation in the time also that is the velocity you can say is 120 can have the different effects